the great leader john maxwell once said leadership is like swimming it cannot be learned by reading about it it takes practice my dear friends this is vinith some 12 years back when my authoritative manager left the company suddenly i was asked to lead a large team of developers and team lead i knew that i would need to bite off more than i could chew but most of the time jobs don't give you multiple choices isn't it but being an untrained leader the most natural thing for me was to follow my manager which i did i started following his leadership style and started leading the team by authority and it did work initially friends i remember one of my team leaders said to me sir you lead your team by iron fist i felt so proud about myself i felt like a king how it to my surprise my rule didn't last for long i started hearing murmurs of revolt here and there and gradually the big team made my life harder and harder and even my bosses started getting complaints about my authoritative style it went to an extent that finally i had to resign from the company i decided never to be a manager and instead remain an individual technical contributor all my life but being an engineering mind i wanted to do the root cause of analysis for my leadership failure there and i found that history is full of evidence of authoritative leadership that could not last for long that could not endure the downfall and disappearance of king are significant i understood that people do not follow authoritative leadership for a long duration and in my pursuit of learning leadership i started exploring leadership roles with multiple voluntary organizations like peak impact mentorship toastmasters and others by listening and following my mentors there i realized that leadership by consent of the followers is the only brand that can endure that can last leadership by consent is also called permission leadership servant leadership i learned many attributes of servant leadership there but for the brevity let me just tell you three key points about servant leadership the first is sympathy and understanding the servant leader must be in sympathy and empathy with his followers he must understand them and their problems not only at a professional level but also at a personal level he should build that relationship with everyone the second point is willing next to assume full responsibility the servant leader must be willing to assume responsibility for the mistakes and the shortcomings of his followers if he tries to shift his responsibility he will not remain the leader if one of his followers makes mistakes and shows himself incompetent the leader must consider that he failed not the leader not the follower and the third important thing is cooperation the servant leader must understand and apply the principle of cooperative effort and include his followers in all his decisions and also induce the same feeling in the followers so friends in 2018 i got an opportunity to explore servant leadership by mentoring few people through peak impact mentorship in 2020 i started my own personal development company organization called unlimited potential india now the same guy who used to hate leading people was leading team of more than 100 people and were responsible for their development journey i was surprised friends that in my earlier avatar of so called leader 
people were not happy to work with me even though i was responsible for their career their appraisals and now in contrast in this voluntary organization people are ready to go extra mile for me even though i don't pay them anything this impact was testimony of the fact that servant leadership in me has started developing and servant leadership is the need of the hour in the words of stephen covey the very top people of truly great organizations are servant leaders thank you so much friends see you bye and yes i forgot just one thing friends so today we have this amazing session of pim workshop at 9 pm being every saturday at 9 pm we have this amazing session of pim and today again vijay himself is going to be there and talk on an important topic that is going to change your life so be part of the session hope you have already booked your slot if not book it immediately and be part of that session and tomorrow we will have book club again that is going to give you exposure of public speaking and community so thank you so much friends see you bye